Well, looks like that tire actually creates an airtight seal with the ground. If I put some weight on it, then you get less spillage. That's ridiculous, except now I'm about to make a huge mess. So I'm going to take care of this real quick. Okay, bye. Welcome to today's vlog. It's day 908. It's been raining all day. It's 60 something degrees out here. My mom came out and said it was freezing. Well, I'm hot because I've been working. I know I said I wasn't going to do it, but I just did. And I'm really glad I did actually because it looks awesome. I just clayed and used the Autosol metal polish on both back wheels. And they look as perfect as they have ever looked. I mean, neither one of them are legitimately perfect. They don't look factory new. But my God, are they close to it now. They look really excellent, especially since I painted the lug nuts. So that means all, all four wheels now are sm almost as smooth as the paint after Zeno. They look really good and they're really clean and I'm happy about that. So now I'm gonna go inside and try to straighten my back out before I die. Wheels are done, now fighting with Sparrow. I don't know, anybody else use the Sparrow mail client? All it says is connection error. I mean it works but that comes up literally every five minutes and it gets to be really annoying. Anyways, Alex updated or uploaded a new video, not Gardner Alex, somebody in, in the UK. Um, about his his aftermarket headlights. So I guess I'm gonna put that together, throw that up on E39 source. I'm starting to get stuff organized here. It's coming along nicely. This is the Mophie thing for the iPhone 5. I'm using that every day. And I don't know how you say this. It kind of showed up on my desk, but it smells really good. Explain what you just did. So I spent the afternoon replacing this because I don't know if it's actually in any of the clips, but this window seal was just shot. We can go and look at the other one, but. Yeah, win window shield. Seal. Window shield seal. And I had this little chip here that's in the windshield is repaired. It's more better. It's a lot more better. Yeah. There's two things that need to be done, but take a look at this. Okay, we got old one here. It's just rattered and tattered beyond belief. It breaks apart in your hands. Yep. It's dick. So, yeah. so it's been replaced. Now we're going to Summit Racing to find differential fluid and transmission fluid. We have uh, 54 minutes before they close. Can we do it? No, well, we got here on time. And it's really foggy. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and cross our fingers and hope we find what we want. Well, it's a freaking Tory store in there. We got our transmission and differential fluid here. We went the Royal Purple Synchromax for whoops, manual transmission. So we're gonna go home through Akron now. It's 1.13 in the morning. My laundry room smells like car products. To most people, it would probably be disgusting to me. Well, makes my back hurt one, but other, other than that, I like it. So we got the stuff from uh, Summit Racing. I'm back now. I'm gonna try to get to bed soon. I'm trying to fix my schedule. In here in the corner of my garage, there's there's a man's garage for you. We got a got a floor jack, transmission and differential fluid, jack stands, an axe, which isn't mine, a tuberfer, and a small piece of wood for the jack. Well, here's what we ended up getting: Royal Purple Synchromax High Performance Manual Transmission Fluid. Good stuff. There's two of those. And the differential fluid is this Royal Purple Max Gear uh, with Cinerlec High Performance Gear Oil 75W140 with friction modifier additive for limited slip differentials, which the M5 has. So I did a Coda Z6 today. I already told you about the wheels. That came out really well. Happy, clean. Only thing I have to do now before Timmy Fest Saturday is uh, my exhaust tips need to be detailed. I know, you guys think I'm nuts. I clean out my car's exhaust pipes. Sorry, that's me. Like me or leave me. Um, what else do I have to do? I might do a Coda Z8. It is not as smooth as it was before. It's still like a new car, but I can make it better. And if I can make it better, I'm gonna do it. It has dropped to about 55 outside, a comfortable 62 in here. We're gonna have some people over tomorrow. We're gonna get some good pictures. We're gonna have some nice cars. I can't wait. Tomorrow uh, evening, afternoon, late afternoon, early evening. However, there's a lot of work to do I need to, I, there's a lot of work that I need to do for tomorrow. It rained all day today. Great timing for me to have to mow four yards in two days. Just freaking awesome. So hopefully tomorrow it dries out enough that I can use this without sinking it up to there in mud. So we'll see where that gets me. But I'm gonna go in and do my shower and do my routine. And hey, guess what? Email zero, watch later playlist two, which I'll do tonight. So we're right on top of the ball with that, which I love. So we'll do yards, a little bit of car work, and let the fun begin for about like, like two weeks. I can't wait. All right, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Oh, shit. this door is locked. Good thing I have my keys. All right, good night.